What's up guys, Wolfish here. I feel like I'm ready for another adventure. I've explored um, weird, like abandoned mansions, uh, other dimensions, abandoned Soviet uh, camps for kids. We've been to an abandoned, or uh, I mean haunted Soviet apartment. Um, so I guess it's time to explore an abandoned creepy hotel. Um, or is it? I'm not too sure if it's abandoned, but I'm pretty sure it is haunted. So, in this story, we get to explore things. There's like a, a little bit of a mystery. When it comes to the story, we need to find out what happened in the past. After the death of Ashley Anderson, who worked as a service worker at the Greenwich Witch Hotel, unexplainable events occur on the night of October 6th when Ashley went to clean room 352. She was attacked by a customer in the room. Despite all the interventions, the young girl dies. Uh, after the unbelievable murder, the attacks admit that they used Ashley for their ritual in the room. The attackers. Exactly one year after the incident, the customers who stayed at the room 352 are found dead. When the authorities cannot clarify the mysterious incident, they decide to shut the hotel down. But even though the hotel is closed, it is said that every year on October 6th, the lights turn on strange noises and hear inside. Are, are these claims really true? To investigate the situation, Detective Aaron Parker sets off to Greenwood Hotel. Oh man. It is haunted. It's not abandoned. I'm sorry. I messed up at the beginning. It is haunted. Definitely. As you can tell from the loading screen. Whatever that thing is, sure is gonna be fun. Chapman will always be watching you. Okay, flashlight. Yep, that's convenient. Oh, and we can run as well. Fantastic. Why do you have to turn up the flashlight? Hotel Greenwood, 9.30. Hello, detective. I'm Chapman. I will assist you in this investigation. We need to find out what's really going on in the hotel. Two years ago, the electricity distribution companies cut off the energy of this hotel, but still the lights turn on by themselves on the same date every year. No one has been able to clarify this situation. Oh, so it is abandoned. That's why we need your help. I'll be watching you no matter what. So okay. you don't have to worry about. You just be careful. Anyway, you can start your investigation in the lobby. Just make sure you don't miss anything. Good luck. Yeah, thanks a lot, man. I will... I'm pretty sure I'm gonna need it. So yeah, it is a, an abandoned hotel. When I saw the lights for a second there, I thought I was... ...mistaken. Well, what can I say? The interior is nice so far. Um, I'll I prefer exploring stuff with lights on. Thank you very much. A modern statue. Okay, so if we're picking this up, does that mean there's something? It's like you know in Resident Evil games. Huh. Paint bucket here is so random. Okay, here goes nothing. Upstairs or downstairs? There's a 
creepy blinking lights there, so I guess I'll explore downstairs first. Oh, same thing here. Right, uh, password. For that we need to go upstairs, I suppose. That was a waste of money. No soda. In every game, there is a wheelchair. Okay, so how do I get in here? What do I have with me? Oh, okay. It's convenient. At least that we don't have that many floors. There's so many things we need to get. So I need to get something to unlock those doors downstairs, uh, to get rid of the chains, need to get a pass card, ID card to unlock the other one as well. I forgot which room number was the haunted one. Huh. So every single room is locked. Don't tell me the piano is a part of the part of the puzzle. Yep, so I've checked everything on this floor. So weird, where am I supposed to be looking for the password then, if everything's locked? Unless it's the computer downstairs. There's gotta be something I'm missing here. Oh, there you go. Greenwood offers you a privileged experience combining comfort and convy. Whatever that is, whether you are a backpacker, a solo traveler, or with your family, or a hotel with 
top of the range service will meet all of your expectations. More than just hotel, Greenwood offers you a place to live and meet people. Yeah. Oh, there we go. Which key is that? Which room? Room 247. Okay. Anything else I can get here? Okay, just double checking. Let's go and find out what we have in room double 247, shall we? This is exciting. Two four four two four seven must be upstairs. Yeah. Yeah, definitely. Unless Uh I hope it's upstairs. Oh no. Yep, so it's in the other part, so this is already floor, so the third floor must be in the other part of the floor downstairs. Which is unfortunately locked. Yep. Yeah, this is definitely downstairs. Not a, lot of, not a lot of clues on what to do, though. Obviously, this is locked, so... Just gotta be like bull cars or something. Yeah, I don't know the password yet. That's pretty obvious. Yeah, I guess it's just um, the obvious things. Um, press right mouse to inspect objects. Got room 244. 343. Three. Nice! So 
So, 244, 247. Oh, there we go. Hello. Whatever happened here wasn't nice, I guess. So what kind of clues are we expecting to get? Can I open anything? Oh. A kitty picture. So cute. Nothing under the bed. Nothing in this room, so... There is a phone though, but can't... Hmm. Okay, turned off the lights just in case. Was hoping to find something extra. You probably wouldn't see when the lights are on. What, I s what if I switch this off as well? Ooh, so shiny. Okay, getting goosebumps already. <laughs> right, so that was 244. We've got... 247 as well, which is probably on that other side, which is locked. Yep. Three for three. Three for six. Three for seven. Three for three. Where is it? It's probably the other way. Yeah, definitely. I remember it was like room three, four, something. The the one where they commit committed the crimes, where the ritual took place. Three, four, four. Three, four, five. Oh. Yes. The lights are on. Is that a good sign? I can turn on the lights in the bathroom and it also has frosted glass which is a nice sign but before I get myself killed ooh, there is more blood yeah so this is the room where they did the ritual stuff my name is Frank, I work for the Broadway News Agency. I came here without anyone's permission to do a story to investigate Ashley Anderson and the 6th of October events. My purpose was only to prepare news about the hotel, but now I can't get out of here. The rumors were true, this place truly is, truly is cursed. I've been hearing strange noises since I arrived. Uh, there are writing, 
written in blood on the walls and I don't know what to do. I think the best option is to wait until help arrives. I'll be hiding in the basement. Please help me, God forgive me for my sins. Is there someone else inside? This is so weird. Jeez. I knew something unusual was going on in this hotel. You have to help that poor man, but be careful. We don't know who he is. The voice... The voice is so robotic, dude. So is it that kind of horror game where you go somewhere and then you're trapped? Like in another dimension or something? Can't leave the hotel anymore? Ooh, it's locked. Okay. So... In both of the rooms I couldn't really find anything. Just like... Um, just one note so far. Okay. There is a briefcase. Anything without the lights on? Yeah, still nothing. Still broken and locked. Okie doke. I am leaving. Three four three checked. Two four four two four seven. How did I get to 244 though? That's the main question. Oops, wrong turn. Unless something happens when you visit all of the rooms. Nothing unusual. Shall I try going downstairs? See if uh, anything changed? the lights how come there the lights are off and there's creepy music playing now dude what please help let me leave and why always it's just one guy who's investigating these kind of things Come get me, ghosts. Come get me. Really, what's up with the lights? Where did the statue go? Huh. Dude, the statue is not here. <laughs> what? Okay. Still locked. What about the table? Go 
call for help. There's no point to go downstairs because still no, got no password. Oh, that's new. Damn it. The situation is worse than we thought. I'm going to send a team there right away. In the meantime, find a way to get in. Find out the password by the Chapman and his uh, crew. Yeah. Yeah. I just can't read sometimes. Whatever they're doing, they probably... Even if they get inside of the hotel, it's gonna be like a separate kind of thing, like in those movies. So you'll be like in a separate dimension, so they won't see you, won't hear you, like whatever. Okay, now then. Things have changed. Huh. Will I get more clues? Tell me what the password is, please. Give me a sign, any sign. Crap. Okay. I thought all of the lights were off as well on the third floor. What about the piano?
to Greenwood. <laughs> and a smiley face, yep. Thank you for that. I suppose now I can unlock... I can unlock that door downstairs. Forgot uh, which floor I'm on, I'm on though. Is it the second or third one? Okay. Okay. Who is that? Hey. Right. What is going on? <laughs> How come the flashlight all of a sudden became so useless? Oh man. Of course it's locked. Right, I just want to get out of here. Thank you very much. Wait. Is the floor a little bit different now? No, still the window is over there, which means... The flashlight is so... <laughs> Dude, come on, it's just a picture. <laughs> Let's play a game. Sure, did why not? Oh, man. It's coming from there, isn't it? Oh, gee. Jesus. Z -z -z. Ruh, ruh, ruh. Arr. Arr. I don't want to go there. Arr. 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 This room is still fine. Okay, never mind. Never mind. For a second there, I was hoping I'd be locked in. Okay, where's the stairs? Or I can't see crap, man. belong to one of those doors on the ground floor. Ah, okay, so not this one then. Okay, there is my sign. Oh, you asshole, Lola. list that is so useful unless there is a password here nah seems to be a bit useless but why are we here nice please give me that Yes, I want it. Give me the screwdriver, please. Yes, I need it. Can they just... Okay.
a bunch of keys, flashlight. Yeah, so I want to take the screwdriver. I don't, I don't understand why can't I take it? Okay. Oh, there we go. Two for one. Or two, yeah, two for one, I think. Oh, game saved. Nice. This is gonna be fun, I can tell. It's gonna be a little... A bit of a pain in the ass to actually find the stairs now, because... Vision... Is so limited, dude, I really can't... Can't see where I'm going. Really, dude, come on. Was here somewhere. Okay. Please tell me I'm gonna find a password in the room 241. I'll be pretty upset if I can't find it. Um, two, four, three. Jesus. Ra 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 ra. Two, four, o. Oh. Two, four, one should be here somewhere. I can feel it. Yes. Yes, dude. Ra ra ra. Ra 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 ra. Ra 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 ra. Nothing's here. Okay. You get like a whole bunch of these random items that you're thinking like, oh, this is definitely gonna be a thing. Um, I'm so hungry, I wish there was something to eat. Oh, 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 hold on. Or, or, Okay, go back to inspecting noodles. How come it's blurry? Dude, I'm really interested in, in to see what's inside the box. Fortune cookie, there's a fortune cookie. Really, dude, I'm really interested in this. I don't want to see what's behind me. Ah, oh, come on. That is so random. I'm so hungry. I, I found some, like, a fortune cookie here, and then... Arr! 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 Hungry! <laughs> yeah, it says hungry. Don't mind if I do. Ooh, what do we have here? Meal of the day. Fresh human head meat. Blended uh, with wine and blood. And a smiley face. Enjoy your meal. Aw, so sweet. No, thank you. I think I'll pass. Now can I at least leak that box? Okay, fine, I'll have that hat, come on. Give it to me. Okay. How do I eat? Well, I mean, as long as I... How do I move this? It's a bit unrealistic. Just move it, come on, dude. Why 
Why is it so dark all of a sudden? The candle's out. Where's the, where's the switch? What the? I swear there was a light switch here somewhere. Ah, <laughs> 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 uh, dude, that's a bit random, but okay. Yay, the table is out of the way. So whatever is going on, I wonder if it's just a uh, victim's ghost, a ghost, or some creepy uh, satanic shit is going on. Oh, this game is saved. Ooh. Okay. Okay, the door is locked. I've got myself a Ouija board. Uh, I don't suppose you know the password for the downstairs door, whatever it is. I will no longer run away from it. It's time to face my fear. I tried to talk to him with this thing I found in the basement. When I called Ashley, they said she was no longer here and that they had taken over her body. I asked them to release me. They said they were keeping me captive at the hotel until someone else took my place and that I had until the end of October the 6th, otherwise I would never get out of here. After that moment I realized that there was no hope left, the demons have taken over here and they won't let me go, so I guess it's too late for me now. Uh, so I guess I know whose head was served with wine. I don't suppose it's gonna talk to me. One, two, three. One, two, three, six, nine. Right? One, two, three, six, nine. Okay. One, two, three, six, nine. I guess that's the password. Okay, screw it. Yellow. One. Oh, actually, one three six nine. Okay. Yep. I got the password. Um, which way to the stairs again? Okie doke. Dude, I can't see a thing. One, three, six, nine. One, three, six, nine. Huh. Dude, I really can't see shit. Noise. Mm -hmm. 
The guy was hoping to be safe in the basement. How did that go for you, dude? Let's see if you're safe. The door is stuck from the back. Okay. Ooh. Ooh. Uh, easy choice. What do we have here? Oh, need a screwdriver, which is upstairs. Ah, oh, dude, why you keep forcing me to go upstairs? <coughs> uh, God damn it! I just want the screwdriver. Come on. Oh, actually, it's fine. It's not too far away. It's just here. Yoink. What was that? Anyone there? Oh, the doors have disappeared as well. So it's just like a wooden wall here now. Definitely trapped in another dimension, like in a Blair Witch. Blair Witch. Some creepy ass dude as usual. <laughs> and the vent is leading straight to the other room. That's nice. That's really nice. I'm kind of afraid to go. Is that the dude? This might come in handy, I guess, if it's still if it's here for no reason. Dude, you okay? Arrrr. Just want to move the chair real quick. Bye. Bye, dude. Thanks, bye. Which key did I just pick up? to room 352 yeah 352 uh, I don't want to try my luck but I feel like Final note. Okay, I'm out of here. I am out of here. What does it say? I don't know how long I've been here. It's like time is frozen. The demons don't let me live or die. Um, maybe I'm already dead. Who knows? My soul is getting weaker day by day. I have nothing left to eat. And worst of all, I uh, may have found a, a way out of this situation. But I have no strength left to do it. The only way is to break the spell and release Ashley. For this I need five candles and I'm and an item belonging to Ashley. After all of these materials are found, they should be placed on the pentagram I drew on the ground. So the spell cast on Ashley that night will be gone. At least I hope so. Anyway, it doesn't matter what I say, I'm now dead and faithless man. Are you sure you're dead are you sure you're dead, buddy? Okay. There's another vent. 
Okay, never mind. Oh, so I can't crawl past it, okay. Never mind. Complete the ritual. Where do I get the candles though? Must be in that room. Which is... Three, five, two. Uh-oh. Yep, the phone is ringing, definitely. And I bet it's coming from room 352. Okay, 342. Come on, where is it? Where is it? There it is. Game saved. So this is the crime scene where the ritual took place. Where do I get the candles? Staff card. Okay. But I... I don't get it. Where do I use the second staff card? Evidence. Can I pick it up? It's weird. Huh. Yeah, like I said, I don't really understand. I haven't seen any other any other door where we can use the, the staff card. Oh, okay, right. So it's a personal item for the ritual, I understand now. So just need to find some candles. And I remember there was a candle in one of those rooms, actually. Either here or on the second floor. Must be the second floor, then.
Yep, so definitely not here. Dude, this is so difficult to find a way back. Okay, there's the room, there's another room. Where's the corridor? Where's the hallway? Oh, come on, dude. Aha. Uh -huh. Okay. Candles anywhere? Oh, there you go. Need a couple more. So, second floor. Yep. Number two, I think he said something about three candles, right? Was it three candles? Don't remember how many... Oh, there we go. Three. That's that, I guess. So two rooms on each floor. Um, somehow have to break the chain to get inside. Uh, what are the options? I think it's the statue, right? Can we get the statue? It looked pretty sturdy. It was here somewhere. Why is it in, why is it invisible now? I don't get it. Now how do I break the chains? Oh, right, there was something in that vent. <coughs> huh? I guess I shouldn't have done that. Okay, you okay, dude? Whoopsie. Things just became more complicated. Is it this thing? Oh, I guess not. Dude, you okay? Yeah, he doesn't doesn't really look alive. 
Why am I still crouching? Okay, so nothing here. Still can't go past this. Okay, fine. Huh. How do I break those chains though? Probably should have tried the ritual first. Obviously I don't have enough stuff to finish it, but... Yeah, four candles are required for this. Well, I suppose uh, I'll find out how to, um, you know, survive in the next part. Thank you guys for tuning in, and I'll see you in the next one. Hmm, after running around for uh, another 10 minutes, I realized that it's... Um, we do need bull cars, but for some reason I never noticed that they were downstairs on the shelf. I like passed this room so many times and I passed the bull cars by so many times, but for some reason I just never noticed. Uh, it's, a, it's a neat trick I suppose uh, when the lights went out. I, will, I probably would have seen it otherwise. Got the bull cars finally. The last candle, here I come. didn't find any extra keys though so unless it's one of those keys from the beginning not me who's knocking, right? Yeah, I don't think so. So, I got... Let's see here. 241 2 
247. Aha, uh -huh. okay. This is 248. 251. 246. 247. There we go. Okay, bring it. What's this? Looks like a drawer key. Oh, it's probably the one from downstairs. That I couldn't open at the very beginning. Yoink. Final last candle, dude. I'm out of here. I am out of here. Really? <laughs> oh, thanks, dude. Gee, thanks a lot. I couldn't really understand which way I needed to go. Since uh, you pointed in the right direction, I suppose I don't have a choice. <laughs> oh god. Okay. <laughs> Was there a reason we were supposed to... Um Is there a reason we saw the body? Now, the only thing is... I suppose I need to... Find a way how to lit... The candles. So, unless I'm missing something. Should be on this floor. In this room. Open any of the drawers. Please open the door. Wait, so. This is the first room. Wait, am I? Yep, I'm in a different room now. Oh no. Never mind. Okay, let's see what they have downstairs in that drawer. Ah, oh, man. Come on. Another key two four five two four five two four five. Two, four, five. <laughs> what do we have here? Oh, another candle. Thank you very much. I'm gonna need a lighter. Oh, nice. Killing one bird, w two birds with one stone. Great. Gathered all the items. Oh, finally. All that's left is go to that creepy ass basement to complete the ritual. It's gonna be funny if we're gonna be the replacement for that guy. So all all of that for nothing just to save the other guy. Okay, 
think that's convenient. How come the lights are on now? Guy's gone. So am I the replacement for the guy? Reach the exit. There is no exit. There is definitely no exit now. Mm -mm -mm, no siree. Good luck with that, my dude. You'll be staying here for a while. Trust me. Trust me. Where are you? Dude, why are you staying there? Just go. Just go, dude. But after the day, he was gonna tell me it was a hotel. <laughs> he was never heard from again. Nobody or any was found at the hotel. During the search, after the reactions, the authorities decided to move on to the hotel. And since then, the Greenwich Hotel has been buried in history, blah blah blah. Yeah, so there was no way out. Basically, stuck in that hell or whatever that was forever. Um. Yeah, it was pretty good, I'd say. Uh, it was a little bit frustrating to run around with that um, limited vision opening all of the doors, but whatever. Uh, the story is not, I can't say it's like a cliche story, but like from watching all of those uh, scary movies and playing scary games, I kind of had an idea that like once you enter the space, there's no way out, basically. But yeah, it was a pretty decent one. Um, if there's anything similar to this like from same developers maybe i'd definitely give it a go and yeah if anyone asks i do recommend this game so i'll be seeing you guys in the next episode Arr -arr -arr.